Hey everyone, and welcome to another Crusader King 3 quick mining tutorial on the Iron Workshop. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to change the color of a title or a country in Crusader Kings 3. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new mod, just so that I don't modify any original game files. If you already have a mod, you can just include the steps that go after creating the mod in your own mod. So let me just go to the launcher, mod tools, create mod, we'll just call it the color mod. Obviously you can call it whatever you want. We'll just give it uh, some tag, create mod. Excellent, our mod has been created. The next thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to open my Crusader Kings 3 mod folder. You can find that folder in Documents, Paradox Interactive, Crusader Kings 3 mod. And in here you'll have the folder that we created in the launcher. And I'm also going to open the game folder, the original game folder, which you can find in Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Crusader King 3. And in here we'll go into Game. Next we'll be copying some files. So I'll open the folder of my mod. And I will first of all create the common folder. And inside of the common folder, there is a folder called landed titles. So let's create that folder inside of the common folder, landed titles. And in here, you'll have a folder called landed titles 00. So let's just copy that file over here. And I'm just going to change the name of this file. I'll call it new colors. Excellent. Now let's open this file that we copied. And in here I'll need to locate the title for which I want to apply a new color. Now this can be a bit complex, but the way that this file is structured, once you start looking for titles, it'll be much easier to find them. Usually they have a very specific prefixes. For example, K stands for kingdom. So if you want to change the title of a kingdom, then you will need to search for something that starts with a K. Counties begin with C. Empires begin with an E. So for the purpose of this lesson, I'm going to change the color of the Holy Roman Empire. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to search for HRE. And here we go, we have E, HRE. I know that this is the HRE since it's an empire level title. So I'm going to copy this whole thing. I'm going to cut just so that we can remove everything else from this file. And what I'm going to do next, I'm going to press Ctrl plus A on my keyboard. I'm going to press delete and just paste only the EHRE entry so that we don't overwrite anything else. Excellent. Now let's save it. And in here, I will be applying the new color which will be shown on the map. Now these colors use the RGB red, green and blue scheme. So you will need to find some kind of way to let you know the correct color code in numbers. And you can use paint.net in order to find your color. So once you open paint.net, you can use this color wheel in here just to find the exact color that you want. In here, you can click on more and it will open the information for this color, which will change according to the color that you picked. So you see that once I have this pink color in here, I see that the R, G and B values for this color are these. So I'm just going to copy them over. So let's apply that 240. Seventy six and 255, which we already have. So I'm just going to save it. And now the HRE is supposed to have a new color in the game. Let's just start the game to make sure. All right, so as you can see, now the Holy Roman Empire has this very manly pink color. And that is all you need to know about changing the colors of titles on the map in Crusader Kings 3. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video, lesson or tutorial on the Iron Workshop. Bye bye.
Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a like. The algorithm and me will be very happy. Here are more videos I make. If you like my stuff, consider subscribing to be notified when new content is available. The Iron Workshop lives and thrives thanks to the continued support of my Patreons. If you are willing and able, you can support me on Patreon for just one buck and get access to exclusive and early content. See you around.